All right, so now here we'll convert our app from a single provider, single block provider to multi-block provider. Now we do have already two block, so we're gonna use them over here. And let me comment this out first so that uh, we know what we are doing and make sure that uh, we don't have any errors. Now for this home section over here, we'll start creating multi-block provider. So here we'll do multi-block provider, this one and uh, like this i'll have brackets and after that because we have a lot of blocks over here block provider now it takes a provider properties which is a list of providers and beautiful and you see that uh, we still have an error and because it wants a child just like this one when you have a uh, just single block provider you need a child and multiple provider you also need a child one more time because it needs an entry point okay so this is our child now here we see that we had a provider earlier so first thing we could do we could go ahead and copy that so here was our provider and uh, let me copy all of this from here and then i'll put it inside now definitely the ch the child we are not going to put inside so i'm gonna cut this we don't need this now and over here let's make it look beautiful we are more organized so that is our first provider that we are injecting over here now what about the other provider so this is the provider that uh, or actually this is the qubit that we created right or this is the block that we created now we are going to inject it over here now for this one we'll just do it manually so we do block provider and now once again over here we need to say the type of the block and what is the type of our block that is work out work out qubit so i think this is the type of our block okay now even though we are using qubit but uh, injecting the blocks same as injecting injecting the qubits are same as injecting the block so you have to mention the type of your block or qubit like this great and right after that it wants us to return an instance of the block now over here we have this create method create property now which takes build actually we need to pass a function to it and the function takes build context and uh, we can create a variable out of that and we call it context and right after this so we're gonna have this work out a qubit class okay or which is our qubit all right so with this now we have two uh, block providers as you can see or two qubit providers